I just want to welcome everyone to the DDSB's first annual um, Cypher Male Black Empowerment Conference. So make some noise once again, ladies and gentlemen, for it. Okay. All well, today, it's about uh, black male empowerment. The idea that brought it together was uh, D-Ben and the board uh, in affiliation with uh, Durham College to sort of get young men, grade eights, nine and 10, to network with each other, with teachers, with uh, members in the community, and to get them to think about their, their futures, what they're gonna do, uh, to make them aware of what's happening uh, now, how they're seen, and to get them to focus on changes they can make in the future. So Cypher is basically a uh, a gathering. It's like a group discussion. It's like a talk. It's a it's a rap session, right? And so this is basically what the conference is. It's a talk. And it's a discussion about uh, what we can do and what we can achieve. And uh, you know, obviously, we have it in the in the keynote section with the large gathering. But we also break into smaller discussions so that uh, young people and uh, the workshop leaders, the mentors can also get an opportunity to talk to each other. I think this event is something that is long overdue and it's something that I wish that I had. So many times black males get left out of the loop um, and we get generalized or we get stigmatized just because that they think that they know us but there's so much more that we go through and struggle with and I think having this open, open forum where they can speak freely is going to be very very empowering, very very helpful in the progression so that they can move forward with their lives and be more successful in the future. Most importantly, I would want them to take away the fact that their race is not a boundary. It is not an obstacle, and, it, it, and although it can be challenging, that anything is possible once you put your mind to it. And I think that what we lack sometimes is giving the students opportunity to actually have a voice in this up and this safe space will be very very helpful for them to express their needs and wants and their inspirations um, that, they, that they would like to move forward with i just want to be loved not for who you think i am or who you want me to be i want to be loved for me a black man who is in love with his people but not at the expense of his love for all people because the price of hating others is that you love yourself less yet hate runs deep in the hearts of many I'm a black man who daily overcomes fear and shyness to speak in a world where it is far easier to remain silent. I'm a black man who is a work in progress. What you see is what you get, and by tomorrow I might have changed because I'm not too old to grow. And until God comes down and clutches me from this earth with his hands, nothing will ever stop the making of this man.